Good Morning Las Vegas continues. Well, school may be over for high schoolers across the valley, but for some, they'll be spending the summer preparing for their future. Bank of America has chosen five students to participate in its student leaders program. Joining me now are Nelson and Carl. Good morning. I know it's a little early, Good so <laughs> thank you. But you're like, oh, gosh, I, I was done waking up early for school, right? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I was just like, oh, it's so early now. Happy summer to you. Thank Welcome. you. Happy summer. <laughs> So tell me about this program Bank of America has going on. Well, Bank of America has been sponsoring for the last 11 years a student leaders program where they take five students and for a year they immerse them into different uh, leadership skills um, that they need to prepare them for the workforce. And so they get an opportunity to intern at, at uh, Boys and Girls Club of Southern Nevada. They get a trip to D.C. where they get to network with um, great leaders. And then here they get a mentor assigned to them that helps them along their journey and prepare them for success. Now Nelson, you have been a part of the program and obviously you are in the workforce now. Right. So how do you think the, the program kind of prepared you for that? Sure. Well, I was one of the first recipients uh, 11 years ago when they first started the program. And uh, today at age 28, I'm a state assemblyman going into my second term. Uh, so it definitely connected me to uh, such great mentors in the community who helped me understand the importance of staying involved, uh, being active in your community and giving back. And Carl, what are you looking forward to? I know you're, you're a part of the program this summer. Yeah, I'm really excited to be a part of the program. I'm really looking forward into growing as a leader in the community and just working along with the kids at the Boys and Girls Club. So it will be a really fun summer, and I'm just really excited for it. You guys have a lot going on. You're, you're working with the Boys and Girls Club. Have you ever worked with that, um, the club before? Uh, no, not at all. I come from Clark County Summer Business Institute. So um, you know, work, now working with kids is going to be a new, whole new experience this summer. Yeah, and of course, the field trip is going to be a big. Uh, yeah, I'm sure you guys are all looking forward to that. Yeah, we're looking forward to DC. So it's going to be it's going to be a fun time all around. So um, but you are looking into getting into politics as well, right? Yes, I'm looking forward into, you know, engaging in my community and working along with everyone in Clark County. So it's going to be a really fun time. Can you tell me, uh, Nelson, a little bit about what they do in DC? Obviously, you know, it's, it's going to be, you're getting down to work, right? <laughs> well, of course, yeah, they get immersed into um, uh, this, this, this huge giant, uh, our, 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 our Mecca, right? Um, so they get to meet with great leaders in the community. Uh, they get to uh, have private tours. Um, they get to understand the, the national landscape of how our government works. So it's just a very nice treat and very great to have such young leaders uh, exposed to such a, uh, a great experience that will probably change their lives. And that's a good point. You said um, young leaders. It's, and these, these kids are from Clark County, and you're hoping to stay in Clark County. Is that right? Yeah. So All my friends, you know, I'm absolutely honored to you know, be friends with them. Uh, they're going to Stanford, Yale, Harvard. And you know, me staying here in Clark County, I want to focus on my education, you know, growing our community, helping all of, all of our neighbors around. Um, and I just want to help develop the culture and the diversity here. In Clark County as well. So. And Nelson, what does it mean to have young leaders like Carl stay here in, in our city, in our county, and be able to kind of give back? Well, I personally love it. I think this is exactly what uh, we are asking for. We're asking for opportunities to keep our, 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 our talent here um, and to have them reinvest in our community and to see someone like Carl so eager, ready to jump in. I'm ready for him to take my seat. <laughs> <laughs> I think he's ready to take over. <laughs> but, you know, it just it speaks to the talent that we have here in Nevada and the fact that we just need to uh, get better at embracing our talents, keeping them here, creating programs that incentivizes those opportunities. And uh, he's just a prime example of uh, the future of tomorrow. Don't blush, Carl. Love you already. Carl Nelson, thank you guys so much for thank coming you. this morning and telling us about that great program with Bank of, of America. We'll thank be right you. back after the break.